I'm just about to cover the top 5 mystery shopping websites that will literally get you paid to shop for items at your local store, so let's get started. The first one on the list is called Secret Shopper, and the name is rather self-explanatory. And now guys, in case you're not entirely sure how this process works, let me simplify it for you. You see, once you have signed up on Secret Shopper and your application has been accepted, you will start getting tasks. And whenever you get one, you will have to pretend that you're a customer. You will have to go to some of your local stores, pretend that you're trying to purchase certain items, but in reality, you are taking notes. You are observing. You'll have a list of different requirements that you need to take a look at. And at the end of the test, you will get rewarded for your small contribution. So you're just pretending that you're a regular client when in reality, you are undercover. Once the assignment is done, you will be able to submit all of the information you have collected and receive your earnings. And when it comes to Secret Shopper in particular, it should be available almost worldwide. The first thing you would have to do is choose your country. And you have a wide list of options here. So you should be able to find yours. Once that's out of the way, you can click on this button that says sign up to shop and naturally that will take you to the sign up form. However guys, in order to prove that you actually know what you're doing and you have an idea of what mystery shopping is all about, you need to pass a test. There will be an assessment that you need to pass. It is called the basic certification test and you shouldn't be too scared about it. The purpose of this course is to ensure that you are well versed in the basic requirements of mystery shopping. In other words, they gotta make sure you know what you're doing. Once that is up to the way, you get to submit your personal information. Then number three would be agreeing with all of their guidelines and ultimately you can get your shop ID and password. And if you make it to step number four, you're pretty much perfectly qualified and you can start earning. You have officially become a mystery shopper on this website. But let's just imagine the worst case scenario. Let's say that you do not pass that screening test. So you never get a chance to become a mystery shopper in the first place. This is just the worst case scenario, but we have to consider it. Well, if that is the case, we can move over to the second one on the list. And this app is called Click and Walk. It's not a website, but a mobile app that you have to download on your mobile device. And you can grab it on Google Play. However, to be entirely truthful, the reviews are not that positive. People seem to have a lot of complaints about the app. So that is certainly a slight inconvenience, but you're never gonna know whether or not it actually works unless you give it a try. And when it comes to the upsides, the best part about this app is that you can genuinely see where all of the offers are available on the map. So you can travel to that location, you can go to that store, pretend that you're a regular shop or a regular customer and complete your requirements successfully. So they are going to make everything way more convenient. Number three on the list is a little bit different. You're still gonna pretend that you're purchasing items at different stores, but this time you're getting paid in order to take pictures. I'm talking about the Premise app. What you wanna do is head over to contributors.premise.com and this is how you can earn money to make an impact. You get to share your knowledge and insights to help businesses improve their products and services and make better decisions. What you have to keep in mind is that this is not exclusively a mystery shopping website, which means that the tasks are not going to be as frequent as on the other ones. In other words, you might get a pretty good task every once in a while that pays you quite well, but they will not be as common. So it might take you a whole week before you get another one. You just gotta keep that in mind. When it comes to receiving your actual earnings, that can be done via PayPal, Payoneer, or Bitcoin, depending on the methods you prefer, and also the availability in your country. I know that some of you may not be able to use PayPal, so you may wanna go for another option. What you wanna do is become a contributor by downloading the app on your mobile phone. You can get it for both Android devices and iOS devices, and this time, the ratings are pretty good, especially when it comes to the Android version for some reason. Android users seem to love it. It's got a rating of 4.6 stars out of 5 based on over 10 million downloads and that's quite significant if you ask me. And just as mentioned before, mystery shopping is just one of the things you can do. There are multiple. It's simple to get started, quick to cash out, and you've got a wide range of different options. So I want to let you guys discover their features. I don't want to bore you with the technicalities. It is pretty user friendly, so I'm sure you'll manage it. Up next on the list, we've got BeMyEye.com. What you want to do as soon as you connect to the homepage is switch over to this other section that says work as an eye. I know that may sound a little bit confusing, but it will make sense. What you're doing here is just observing and then reporting. So you get to earn money in your spare time. And by the way, just in case you're wondering, they've got over 3 million people on their app and all of them are completing short missions in the stores near you. So you may not even have realized, but while you are shopping for an item at your local store, you might have actually come across a mystery shopper, but they probably didn't blow their disguise. But here's how it works in a nutshell. This website will also help us get a better understanding of how the process works in the backstage. They work with large brands such as Nestle, Samsung, and a bunch of others by providing data on how their products are displayed in stores. They've got very clear requirements when it comes to placing their 
their products, right? And so as you might imagine, a billion dollar company such as Samsung don't just want to have their items being thrown around all over the place. That is why they've got clear guidelines in place and you're gonna help them make sure that those are respected. They need people like you to collect information and they pay you for that. So it is a fair exchange of values. But let me break it down. The first thing you'd have to do is pick your mission. Moving on, you get to go to the store and their mobile app will also help you with that because it is powered by Google Maps. So you will certainly not get lost. Moving on to step number three, you get to complete the task within the app, then get paid for your effort and that's where the process ends. Not only that, but they will make sure that you actually get paid so you don't have to chase anyone around in order to receive your rewards. They will make sure the payment is done on time. What kind of missions are they talking about? Well, take a look at this. Go to a store, answer a few questions and take a few pictures. That's all. Alternatively, you get to photograph the shelves of an entire category in a specific but 100% guided way. So they will walk you through the process you don't have to worry about getting lost or not knowing what you have to do they will have very clear instructions alternatively you can do the mystery shopping gig this is where you get to speak with the store's employees to know which brands or products they recommend and this is a major one geolocation tasks are also available because you can look for specific kinds of stores or locations and every time you see one you can just add a pin on the map moving on we've got outdoor activities such as hitting the street and photographing outdoor elements we're talking about advertising materials such as billboards or storefronts and ultimately you can also get paid to complete tasks at home without even leaving the comfort of your place you get to answer questions related to what you see on TV or what you think about a specific product. And I think this is by far the best one and the most convenient one, but if you really want to max out on your profits, you want to complete as many of them as possible, even if they might be slightly less convenient. That being said, if you're ready to give it a try, all you gotta do is get the app on your mobile phone and that will help you find all the missions available near you. You can grab it on Google Play and it's got over 1 million downloads, so you're certainly not the first one to use it. And moving on to app number 5, we've got Market Force. But what you want to do is scroll down to the very bottom of their page and pick this option that says become a shopper that's where the magic happens that's what you want to do get paid to shop or eat or even play they've got plenty of options you get to become a mystery shopper for market force and get reimbursed for doing something you enjoy and if you're somebody who genuinely enjoys shopping that is particularly true it's free to sign up it pays and according to the website, it's also important. And I agree with that because you're actually providing useful feedback. So all of these brands can improve their products and services. And just as expected, they have also put together a mobile app that you can download so you can shop on the go. Ultimately, what you want to do is click on become a shopper. That will take you to the sign up form. And when it comes to sending in your application, that's a piece of cake. It's a question of entering in your first name, last name, email address. A zip code will also be required. And then once you've entered in your phone number too, you should be good to go. But we are not done just yet i've got a bonus for you if you guys enjoy shopping and you would like to get paid for doing that here's another option you're not actually going to be a mystery shopper but instead you're going to complete a personal grocery gig in other words you're just purchasing items for someone else and it is a pretty cool side hustle it is certainly not the most demanding one and it get paid quite well the website i have connected to is called instacart.com and this is just one of the multiple options you've got now whenever somebody wants something from their local store they can just place in their orders they can select the items they are interested in and you can go on and do the shopping. However, guys, this is not available worldwide. They are focusing on places in the United States with their top cities being LA, New York, and they've got places such as San Francisco too. If you want to see their whole availability, you want to click on this link that will send you to all of their job locations. And they are currently operating in over 50 states. If you're based in the States, you're pretty lucky when it comes to this one. It's certainly not going to make you rich overnight. You won't pay out thousands of dollars, but it's a pretty good side hustle. And just as mentioned, the amount of effort is not that high. Now, when it comes to signing up, you want to head over to shoppers.instacart.com and this is where you get to sign up. As a shopper, you go to the grocery store like normal, except you're getting paid to shop for others. That's the only difference. Not only that, but you can also work whenever you want to because you're an independent contractor here. You're not making any commitments. You're not working a nine to five. So that will make everything way more comfortable for you. You get to make your own schedule. Not only that, but you can also make a choice. You can either pick the first option that says shop and deliver, where you would also have to deliver the item to your customer or you can just do the shopping that is entirely up to you but as you might expect you do get paid a little bit extra if you pick the first option and also deliver the product in that case you would also need to have a car but that goes without saying and last but definitely not least i've got another bonus for you this one is going to work in a slightly different way instead of getting paid in order to shop you're actually going to get some of your cash back talking about rakuten.com and that is what this website is all about cashbacks Whenever you purchase an item at one of their partner stores, 
such as Walmart, Macy's, or even Lululemon or Nike, you'll get a percentage of your money back. So you're not necessarily getting paid, but you're getting some of your money back. And as people say, a penny saved is a penny earned. So I'll take it. Once again, this is just a bonus, so you don't necessarily have to give it a try. I just thought I would mention it so you can at least know about it. We've got all the resources and all the tools you need to make this work. So that's it for now, and thanks for watching.